Hey, it's Stefan again, and in this little video, you're about to discover the checkbox plugin, which we got going on with the capture feature or growth tools inside Clever Messenger. Now, as I click on checkbox plugin right there, it redirects us to the checkbox library. And as you can see, it's currently entirely empty. So what we are going to do right now is simply creating a new one. So I'm going to name this checkbox plugin, click on OK, and this redirects us to the actual builder. And this is basically divided into two parts. You're you're actually part right here on the left where you can actually set up all the details and configure the checkbox plugin and right here on the right we got the demonstration or the preview if you will now we are going to kick things off with language and it's set to English by the way however if I want to set it up for Spanish I can the preview immediately gets updated and as you can see it's right now featured in Spanish however for this demonstration we are going to go with English there we go and we need to identify a name or ID attribute right here to have Clever Master recognize where to place and to tie it to which button. So I'm going to name this checkbox plugin. There we go. And now I'm moving over to text, which allows me to add text to a user profile whenever a person comes in through a checkbox. Now for demonstration purposes, I'm going to use tag one and tag two. And I can also use URL parameters to custom fields, which allows me to transform or convert the URL parameters you set up in your navigational bar into custom fields right here inside Clever Master. And because it's a little bit of an advanced feature, I'm just going to leave this blank for now. now moving on to the form inputs to custom fields it basically allows me to transform or convert any input that is put in Inside the field into a custom field as well so just imagine that we are tying the checkbox plugin to a actual form field which is a capture field for email then we can basically transform the email that's put into the form and have it reflected inside the user profile right here on clever messenger as well which allows you to further siphon it with the other integrations we got going on basically forwarding that email through other integrations you've set up but you can do a lot more with this stuff as well uh, simply each and everything people put in inside their form you can capture and transform to a custom field so in the case that you want to add this to an e-commerce platform like we can see right here in this demonstration card all the forms whether hidden or not can basically be transformed or converted into a custom field which allows you to basically go really crazy with all the data you are going to capture now because this is an advanced feature as well we're going to simply leave that blank as well we're simply going over to looks right now and this is where we can set up the checkbox size I'm going with extra large right now there we go and now move over to the submitted tab this is where I actually set up the flow that needs to go out once they go through the checkbox there we go and for this demonstration we're going to go with the welcome message as well open up the preview to see if we pick the right message and that seems about right and right here in the bottom where it says submission behavior I can actually check this checkbox right here and this allows me to basically force people to check the checkbox or tick the checkbox if you will in order to move forward or to proceed with the next action so we are basically blocking the action from happening after clicking the button so they actually need to check the box so for this demonstration I'm actually going to enable this let's say please tick the box in order to continue there we go and now we simply need to go to the install tab right there save it first code is actually the code that pulls the data from Facebook and Clever Messenger this actually needs to be placed before closing the body tag and the second code is actually where you want to place the checkbox inside your website and its pages all right so I'm moving over to the Clever Messenger homepage right now as I set up a button right there with the checkbox to demonstrate how this actually works and uh, yeah to give you a cool demonstration all right so we are at the Clever Messenger homepage right now and as I simply scroll down right there I've set up a cool little button right here for this demonstration now once I click on it it actually already features the wording message and it says please tick the box in order to continue and all I need to do right now is basically tick this box right there 
and click on the button. There we go. Awesome stuff. And as you can see right here in the lower right corner, you can see that the message is being sent out. The actual notification red dot right there is increasing. And as I open up this message, you can actually see it right there and it's going out. So that's pretty neat. And that's basically the checkbox in a nutshell for you. It allows you to integrate this with your current marketing strategy right away. Basically append this to your forms, to your buttons in order to generate subscribers quickly and easily. All right, that's the checkbox plugin. Thanks for watching this video and I will see you in any other video on this page. Bye for now.